news at this hour. Arvin police are investigating the death of a karate instructor in town. That's right. Officials say the 65 year old adult male died while demonstrating a hold with one of his students. Let's go out live right now to 23 ABC's Tori Cooper. She's in Arvin with the latest details. Tori. That's right, Mike and Alyssa. I'm right outside of Bear Mountain Elementary School where Arvin police say that incident took place around 845 last night. Now, Arvin police say 65 year old karate instructor Craig Garrett lost his life during a karate class last night. I spoke to his friends who say there are some issues with what happened and the details that are being shared with our community. Now, Arvin police say a witness told them that a student was demonstrating a carotid on Mr. Garrett and that is similar to a chokehold. Now friends I spoke to this morning say that's not what happened. I said you can't choke him out. That's sensei. And he's 6'2. And so it, uh, he's been doing it for like I said for 45 years as an instructor. He studied jujitsu. So he knows the move. If you do one way he'll go the other way. So there's no way you can choke him. But then, like I said with no no uh, chokehold involved. It was grappling. Back live now, Leonard, who is his lifelong friend, says that he has been practicing karate for 45 years and that everybody knew that he was strong and that his wife, like you just heard him say, said that he had potential heart problems. Now, that is something they just learned this morning, and they say they didn't know about that. They said that this is an extreme loss to the community. They say he raised over $45,000 in scholarships for the community, that everyone is shaken by this, and they say that all they can do now is wait for the autopsy. Report. Now we're going to have more details in our five o'clock show coming up tonight. But for now, live in Arvin, I'm Tori Cooper for 23 ABC News connecting you. Tori, thank you for that. And a little breaking news.